Hi, Chris Gaynor here, and in this video I'm going to basically talk to you about a couple of plugins, uh, that, a couple of popular plugins, um, you've probably heard of them, but if you haven't, uh, basically they're SEO plugins that are really useful for your um, blog, uh, writing a blog post, optimising a blog post. Now, um, personally, in my opinion, a lot of marketers make SEO uh, out to be complicated and uh, and um, well complicated <laughs> effectively, but actually SEO is isn't that complicated, uh, providing you've got the right tools to um, track what you're doing when you're writing a blog post or writing on a website. So basically, with SEO. Um, these couple of plugins I'm going to uh, quickly show you today are Squirrely, uh, which is here. Here sits. It sits on uh, here. It's like a. It's um, there are a lot. Uh, there are lots of SEO plugins, paid and free, and uh, I've demonstrated a couple of uh, paid plugins in the past. Um, but if you're not uh, really um, if you're not uh, haven't got the, the financial um, capabilities to buy a couple of paid plugins um, as I say keyword winner is a useful plugin um, because that allows you to get keywords uh, tailored keywords for your blog post uh, easy easily but um, today I'm doing squirrely and as you can see uh, squirrely sits at the side here and basically every time you write a blog post it will t uh, tell you what uh, how you're doing in terms of optimization on page optimization and as you can see I've just written up uh, I'm just in the middle of doing a blog post now uh, well a video as well actually but um, as, as you see when it turns green that means that you're uh, you're doing the right uh, type of SEO. Your your page is being optimised. Every and each time it goes green, uh, the more optimization it will be. So, as I say, Squirrely, if you just type in your keyword here, and then effectively start writing your post. And it will tell you, <coughs> excuse me. It will tell you um, how optimised your your uh, post is. So that's basically squirrely. And then here we've got another useful plugin which sits at, in, at the bottom of my dashboard here, which is WordPress SEO by Yoast. It's free. Uh, both are free. And basically, this is effectively. Uh, to optimize the title of your uh, uh, URL, your URL, your the keyword. So you type in the keyword here, um, as you did in Squirrely, and then you make sure your your keyword is in the title of your uh, page URL, and you also <coughs> type in your um, keyword in the meta description and uh, that's actually basically it with uh, WordPress SEO is it basically keeps you uh, aware of um, wh how whether your page is optimized uh, your title is optimized etc um, so that's WordPress SEO and and the reason why you have these plugins is is because if you do SEO blind i.e. you're just doing it without any of these tools chances are you're gonna make mistakes or you're gonna uh, not your page isn't gonna be as optimized as it could be so having these tools um, if you're doing SEO or if you're uh, wanting to get ranked for a certain keyword um, it's important to have these particular tools as I say there's uh, loads and loads of SEO tools for WordPress that are free and paid but these two in my opinion are 
uh, I feel are uh, the 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 essential, the, really the only essential tools you need, free tools you need for um, <coughs> for your WordPress uh, blog. Okay, so um, as I say, I hope you found that useful, and um, if you've got if you got any uh, comments about SEO, then leave a comment underneath this video. And um, if you uh, think you found this useful and you think someone else would um, benefit from this uh, video and knowing these plugins, then just basically uh, share this in your social networks uh, underneath this video as well. Okay, so this is Chris Gaynor signing off uh, for another video and I'll speak to you soon in another video. Okay, thanks very much. Bye.